Karibu tena mtazamaji. Katibu katika Wizara ya Uhamiaji Balozi Julius Bitoka ametangaza kwamba serikali haitatumia pesa zozote katika mchakato wa kutoa vitambulisho vya dijitali maarufu kama maisha kada kwa wakenya. Bitoka ameongezea kusema kuwa Wizara hiyo imezunguka kote ulimwenguni nchini kumradhi kuyakusanya maoni ya wakenya na hivi karibuni wakenya wataanza kupokea vitambulisho hivyo. Bitoka aliyasema hayo hii leo alipokutana na mashirika ya kijamii ili kuchukua maoni kutoka kwao. And I'm happy to inform the public that today we are at the second meeting. We are the second breakfast meeting with the civil society. And I'm happy to inform the public that the meeting centered on the rollout of the Maisha number ecosystem which is four components that is a Maisha number Maisha card Maisha digital ID Maisha integrated database so I'm happy to announce also that we have started the, the piloting of this very important number and uh, I, I want to inform the public that we are not seeking for extra additional budget for this kind of project we are using the resources that have been allocated within our budget. I've highlighted uh, a number of uh, concerns that civil society uh, from across the country still have regarding the proposed implementation. And we have given um, a document to uh, the government to consider as our proposals. I know we said minimum, bare minimums, but we are calling them proposals uh, for consideration. <laughs> 